There are three total Legoland theme parks in the United States. They are located in California, Florida, and New York, as well as a handful more scattered throughout the world. If you're familiar with Legoland, then you might already know plenty about the well-established California and Florida parks, but probably not so much about the New York park, which was just opened in July of 2021. Each park offers an excellent variety of interactive family rides, building workshops, live shows, and fun attractions though each has a slightly different land offering, ride selection, and dining and lodging choices. Today, we're going to discuss some key differences between the already well-loved Legoland in Florida and the new Legoland in New York. Legoland Florida is located in Orlando. It offers over 50 rides, shows, and attractions, and is considered the ultimate multi-day vacation destination. This is the spot where kids rule the land of dragons, knights, princesses, and adventures. Many families flock to this destination because unlike the newly opened New York version, this park offers a water park as well as multiple different lodging options. Legoland New York is located in Goshen, a village in Orange County, just one hour from Manhattan. It also offers up to 50 rides and attractions. This 520 acre park is the largest of the three and it's also the first new theme park to be built in the Northeast United States in over 40 years. Guests will enjoy state-of-the-art brand new features and amenities throughout the park as well as a convenient cashless pay system. Each Legoland theme park offers up its own variety of lands. Legoland New York offers seven unique areas, whereas Legoland Florida offers 14. You can find the list and location of each of these lands on these downloadable maps. There will be a link to these maps in the description box below. Every Legoland theme park has between 40 to 60 rides, attractions, and experiences. And while many rides have a similar name, similar theme, or similar setup, each park does offer its own unique handful of rides and experiences. Here's a list of some of the unique rides that you can find at these two parks. While the selection of foods available are all pretty much the same as far as kid-friendly choices go, the exact eateries are much different. A kid can find their favorite pizza, pasta, burgers, and hot dogs at each park, and the parents can find their caffeine fix in both parks as well. Some of the places Legoland New York offers include Wizard's Frozen Wonders, Smoky Brick Barbecue, Showtime Snacks, Ninja Kitchen, Royal Feast, Carl's Brick Street Cafe, Legoland Florida offers places such as Taco Everything, Ultimate Sandwich Builder, Kickin' Chicken, Kingdom Cones, Peppers and Roni's Pizza and Pasta, and many more. Lodging is one of the aspects of the two locations that differs the most. Florida offers three lodging options on the resort, including Pirate Island Hotel, Legoland Hotel, and Beach Retreat whereas the New York location offers only one, Legoland Hotel. Each of these Legoland locations would be a great place to go, but I hope this video was able to shine some light on the differences in these two locations and to help you decide which location is going to be the best fit for you. Please like this video and subscribe to the Adventure Student Travel YouTube channel for more informational videos to help you plan your perfect trip.